Like, how about this Britney Griner situation? Yes. Right? Britney Griner is imprisoned right now in Russia yeah. because she went over there to play basketball and she had uh, cannabis oil, oil or vape some shit. cartridges that she had on her. Yeah. She d I, I don't know if she just didn't know they were illegal or if she tried to sneak them in. Uh, and they're, they've got her arrested. It's against the law. And she might do 10 years in jail over there, which is but, fucking horrific. But let's she's, also clarify. She's already been over there for months. But here's what's important. But people are, yeah. but hold on. Yeah. People are freaking out about this, right? They're freaking out. Russia needs to let her go. We have people in America right now locked up for marijuana, and they've been locked up for fucking years. For years That's and funny. years and years. And there's not one. That's there's funny. thousands of yeah, them. Yeah, so yeah. what, they're not good at throwing a fucking ball into a net? Yeah, 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 yeah. Is that what it is? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're not good at that one thing that we like to watch? Oh, so dude. those fucking people yeah. don't get let out? President Biden has just announced that he is pardoning all prior federal offenses of simple possession of marijuana, a step expected to affect thousands of people. Biden is also asking governors to take a similar step for those with state convictions. Senior White House officials estimate that there are more than 6,500 people with prior federal convictions for simple possession of marijuana and thousands of others that could benefit from this relief.